Welcome to the Kitchen of Chaos. Today we're going to do some blue grouse with poblano anaheim chilies and uh, that's pretty much it. So this is a blue grouse that I just got. I have cleaned it and divided up the breasts into largest pieces that were not damaged. There are two breast tenders. There's a large breast here. Uh, then there's most of another breast that was cut up to remove the damaged parts and its legs uh, and the heart. And I didn't do the gizzard because I wasn't brave enough. Um, so I'm just going to slice up an Anaheim uh, pepper and a poblano and uh, an onion and get that going in some olive oil. And then I think we're going to just lightly bread these and salt and pepper and maybe some Mexican seasoning, garlic salt, and uh, cook them. And I think the legs will probably have to go longer, but we'll see. So I ended up doing uh, jalapeno as well. And we're just going to get these until they're soft. I guess it'll sort of be, I don't know, I don't know what's going to happen. Maybe we'll take them out and fry the chicken, I mean the grouse separately. And then uh, serve this on the side or over the top. Anyway, I'm going to put some salt in this and then basically just get it kind of caramelized and done. And uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, so I, put, I ended up putting a little Mexican, organic Mexican seasoning in this as well as some cumin. And it smells good. <coughs> it kind of smells like Indian restaurant. And this has uh, um, garlic powder, or a granulated garlic, um, salt, and a little bit of Mexican seasoning on both sides. And then I'm just going to flour it. And then when these are done, this is done, I'm going to put some oil in here and fry the pieces of meat. And maybe, I don't know, maybe another time I'll do a stew, like a ranchera style with tomatoes base in here. But I think I'm just going to do sort of onions fajitas style today. Okay, so we floured the grouse. We're going to put it in the oil. And so on. Stomach? No, that's the breast. Okay. Your favorite part. <laughs> and mine as well. <laughs> Strangely. That's good. Try it. <laughs> Is it too hot? No, I just... Uh, uh. Yeah, have a secret. Mm. What? What do you think? Delicious. All right. Delicious. Oh. Delicious. Mm. Delicious. You want that nugget? Try that one. Oh. Okay. Now, if you want a you want a a grouse finger, a grouse for the mouse. Mm. Mm. Is it good? Okay. I very much appreciate it. If I could have a if I could have a mm, that's good. You can't have the drumstick. You're gonna have to gnaw on it for a while because the tendons are kind of tough. Mm. Oh. But you don't you don't mind gnawing on things, right? Nope, not at all. <laughs> yeah. That's good. Mm. So the uh, peppers and onions and stuff are awesome. They're sweet and delicious. I got two. The grouse is good. Like like chicken, but it has more flavor. I think I am. It's it's very good. It's got a little bit of a steak savoriness to it. Yeah. Kind of combined with chicken. Well, it's not. I'm gonna try some of this stuff. I think I know why the. You gotta try. You gotta try some of this, Jefferson. I think I know why the tendons are so tight because they have to them a lot. Mm-hmm. Ah. Mm. That's really good. Mm. Oh, that's the good news feeding out. <laughs> No, you guys eat it. Excellent. So, mm. see you next time on the Kitchen of Chaos.